Hello and welcome to another video on this channel. Diversity visa applicants usually ask for directions when they need to resolve problems relating to their case. They sometimes get confused over which entity to turn to when they need answers to specific issues during their application process. But that doesn't have to be the case, as we will find out in today's video. Welcome back to this discussion. As a diversity visa applicant, there is no need to get confused over which entity to contact in case you have issues regarding your case. There are two main entities that are at your disposal when it comes to responding to questions that you may have. So the question is, which one of those entities do you contact at specific moments during your application process? Now, to answer that question, I would say that there are two things you must take into consideration. The first of those things is the subject of the question that you have to ask. If the question that you have to ask concerns your case or the application process in general, then the appropriate entity to direct that question to will be KCC. And that is even mentioned in your selection notification letter. Now, on the other hand, if you have questions that are specific to the embassy that will be hosting your interview, then in that case, your question has to be addressed to the embassy. So you see that the subject of your question can help in determining which one of those two entities you have to address your question to at specific moments during your application process. Now, the second thing you must also take into consideration when you have questions to ask regarding your case is your case status. We saw the different case status and what each of them means in a recent video, but for those of you who did not watch that video, I'm going to include the link to that video in the description of this one. You can click on that link and watch the video for the details regarding the different case status. But as I was just saying, your case status can also help you to determine which one of those entities to direct questions to. And this is how it works. When you check the status of your case and the result of that check returns to you at NVC, it means that your case is still at the level or in the hands of KCC. In such an instance, it is to KCC that your questions should be directed. Now, on the other hand, if you check the status of your case and the result returns to you something other than at NVC, it may be in transit or already anything else other than at NVC, it means that your case has left KCC and has been transferred to the relevant embassy. So in that case, your questions should be directed to the embassy instead. So you see, it is that simple. The status of your case, but also the subject of your inquiry will determine whether your questions should be addressed to KCC or to the embassy concerned. So that is about it for today's video. Thanks for watching it. And if you are not yet subscribed to this channel, then click the subscribe button and also the notification bell so that whenever I post a video, you will be aware. And I will see you, God willing, in the next one. Goodbye.